Sunday on BBC One. At 7.15, we're keeping up appearances, even outdoors. Where's your tie, Richard? Well, I thought since we were going on a picnic. Richard. In trainer at 7.45, infidelity, surprise and other people's wives. Problems? Robert, I'm sorry, I thought you wanted to see me. Robert, darling, what is going on? Robert! Go away, I said! At 8.35, an unwelcome visitor. Hello to ya. And how are you now? There's no stopping you, is there? You're like a scud on heat. In Jute City at 9.20, the strain of Sammy's death is starting to show. If you start poking about in his affairs, you do it with me. Don't give me a hard time, cos I've had a rotten day. Sunday evening on BBC One. We could all be in for a rotten day tomorrow by the look of it. First of all, it will be a wet and windy night over much of England and Wales, the wind touching gale force around the southern coasts and over hills. Over Scotland, the cloud is likely to be more broken, with heavy showers affecting windward coasts and hills. But with winds easing down overnight, there could be a touch of frost and the odd fog patch developing in well-sheltered valleys by morning. Tomorrow it will be another windy day over England and Wales with gales again in the south. The cloud and rain over south-east England will clear during the morning to give dry, bright weather for a time in the east during the afternoon, but showers will spread eastwards on the strong westerly winds. Some of those showers are likely to be heavy with hail and thunder. It will be cold over Scotland and feel very cold further south in the strong, lustrally wind. So our Saturday night comes to a close with the time just approaching 25 minutes past one. Radio offers a choice now between John Peel on one and Alan Didicote on Radio 2. However, if your choice now is to turn in for the night rather than tune in, then I wish you a good night's sleep and hope we have the pleasure of your company again at some time tomorrow night here on BBC One.